It's a common misconception that Vegas is all about the slot machines, craps tables, poker tournaments and other gambling attractions. In fact, gambling only makes up a small percentage of the things that you can do in Las Vegas. Here's our top 50 things to do in Las Vegas that don't include gambling. 1. Go and see a show Vegas is famed for its entertainment. With shows to suit all tastes and budgets, there's something that will enthrall and excite. From Celine Dion's famous residency. There are big names to indulge on. Drake's residency at the Wynn, Lady Gaga's Enigma residency and Brit favorite Robbie Williams is bringing a show to the strip, celebrities are plenty. If you're looking for comedy then there's Carrot Top at the Luxor, Menopause the Musical and Terry Fate are all ready for your laughter. There is also a plethora of Cirque du Soleil shows to be mesmerized by including Michael Jackson's One, O oh and the Beatles Love. If you're looking for some totally different shows then it's worth heading to Best of Vegas to discover all of the shows that Vegas boasts. We highly recommend the Tenors of Rock. There are of course, free shows after all this is Vegas and people want to be picked up for the shows. 2. Ride the Rides. Take a trip to the Strat for a gut-wrenching view. With three rides at the top of the tower including a one which hurtles you over the edge of the tallest Vegas building, it's not for the faint-hearted. Grab an unlimited pass and ride as many times as you wish. If you're wanting to stay a little closer to the ground then hit the rides at New York, New York and enjoy rip-roaring roller coasters at the Big Apple Coaster and Arcade. 3. Travel the world. Yes, I really mean that, travel the world on one strip. From medieval castles to Egyptian pyramids. From New York to Paris to Venice and even the Roman Empire once ruled by Caesar there's certainly a lot to take in if you are looking for a themed hotel to improve a little bit of cultural knowledge. Where else could you go from watching the jousting at the Tournament of Kings in Excalibur to heading to the viewing deck at the top of the Eiffel Tower replica outside of Paris? 4. Visit the Canyon. Okay not strictly in Vegas but if you're looking for a welcome break from the neon lights and the diving slot machines then a trip to Arizona should certainly be on the cards. You can choose helicopter flights or bus tours to take you to the Grand Canyon. It is an absolutely incredible view and I highly recommend visiting the Skywalk on the West Rim. Walk the glass horseshoe shaped bridge 4,000 feet above the Colorado River. 5. Check out all of the animals. Make sure you take a trip to the Mirage's secret garden and dolphin habitat. This attraction has been created to help conserve and look after dolphins and is home to Siegfried and Roy's lions and tigers. Looking for something a little more tranquil, make sure you visit the wildlife habitat at the Flamingo which is home to yes you guessed it their own flock of flamingos. Do be aware flamingos are very smelly. See other interesting and marvelous birds and grab a drink at Garden Bar which looks over the lagoons and waterfalls. 6. Discover underwater creatures. If you're not content with land animals then Las Vegas offers one of the best aquatic attractions at Mandalay Bay. With over 2,000 animals, including sharks, giant rays, endangered green sea turtles, octopuses, piranhas and a Komodo dragon there is plenty under sea life to marvel at. With the introduction of their newest exhibit, Polar Journey. Which is an interactive adventure giving guests a glimpse into the Earth's polar regions and the animals which call these areas home. You can also book to feed the stingrays, sharks or turtles in Mandalay Bay's Animal Encounters program. If you're feeling really brave why not book an experience of a lifetime and swim with the sharks? 7. Shop luxury brands and pick up bargains. The shopping in Las Vegas is an attraction in itself. Each hotel has a great selection of designer shops and on some occasions, they even have their own malls. With the Miracle Mile in Planet Hollywood home to over 100 stores in the 1.2 mile round including brands such as Aldo, House of CB, Lucky Brand, Foot Locker as well as lots of food stops too. The Bellagio offers luxury brands such as Hermes, Tiffany & Co, Chanel, Fendi, Gucci and Louis Vuitton to name but a few. Head to Caesars Forum where you'll discover over 160 stores including Christian Louboutin, Victoria's Secret, Balenciaga, H&M and Henry Bendel. Make sure you stop by Fashion Show Mall located opposite the Wynn for all your high street brands. If you're looking for discount shopping Las Vegas has two outlet malls accessible by cab or by the Juice Bus which runs 24-7 on the Strip. With favorites including Adidas, Ralph Lauren and Tommy Hilfiger the outlets have some amazing bargains. Especially on Black Friday. Personally, I prefer the North Mall, which is the outdoor mall as this has a better selection of stores and is substantially larger. 8. Saw Down A Zipline. 
If you're familiar with downtown, or Old Vegas, which is also known as Fremont Street you'll know that it plays home to Slotzilla. Why not add to your Vegas adventure with a zip line down the street? There are two options to choose from. Zip from seven stories up, for a whole two blocks while flying in the sitting style. Zoom from 11 stories up, a duration of five blocks in the superhero position. You can enjoy zoomlining over crowds of people down at Fremont. Just a little word of warning I have seen many people get stuck in the middle and have to be rescued. So do be prepared for this as you do zoomline. If you're not a fan of Fremont Street, then you can now zipline in the strip at the link. Having recently opened their own zipline, fly link. Again choose from flying seated or superhero, this time 12 floors high above the link promenade in this adrenaline-fueled experience. 9. See Real Vegas History. Vegas was established as a city on May 15, 1905 and the name Las Vegas translates to the Meadows in Spanish, named by the Mexicans traveling through the area which was once wet and marshy before it dried and became desert terrain. Often referred to as Sin City, Las Vegas brought all of the illegal entities together into the desert during the erection of the Hoover Dam and the Prohibition era where fancy cigars were a great status symbol. From the first casino which was built by mafia crime lords to what Vegas has become today is worlds apart. In 1931 gambling in the state of Nevada was legalized. Head past Fremont Street onto North Las Vegas Boulevard where you can visit the Neon Museum referred to affectionately as the Neon Boneyard. Amazing both day and night see the original, and in some cases restored, signs that the casinos once displayed. Not too far from the Boneyard is the Las Vegas National History Museum, which showcases relics from all across the world. Discover the treasures of Egypt, see marine wildlife and be brave enough to check out the prehistoric bison. 10. Enjoy world-class food. With world-renowned celebrity chefs such as Wolfgang Puck, Jose Andres, Giada de Laurentiis, Nobu Matsuhisa, Pierre Gagner and Gordon Ramsay opening restaurant chains in Vegas there is no shortage of exceptional places to enjoy world-class food. Every night choose to dine in a different hotel on the Strip and enjoy world-famous chefs providing a huge array of different cuisines. 11. Visit the beach. Man-made of course, but in the desert, there's no shortage of sand. Tau in the Venetian, Mandalay Bay and Hard Rock Hotel Beach Club have created their own beach resorts for you to enjoy. You don't have to be a resident of any of the hotels to enjoy the facilities. All hotels welcome guests from other hotels openly. With Tau providing a Bali life vibe to Sin City. Enjoy lush landscapes, with 40 feet bamboo trees. Ideal to head to in the middle of summer when temperatures peak. Enjoy the plunge pool, day beds and bungalows whilst the on-beach resident DJ plays some tunes. Mandalay Bay boasts an 11-acre complex which allows you the chance to relax in an enormous freshwater pool with its own wave machine. The beach provides fun for all guests and like Tao boasts cabanas, day beds and beach bungalows which are all for hire. 12. Learn about the mob. Located just off Fremont Street, the Mob Museum is dedicated to educating about the organized crime's history and impact on American society. With a bold and authentic view of organized crime from vintage Vegas to the back alleys of American cities, throw yourself into the way of yesteryear. Explore real-life events and true stories of mob history through interactive exhibits. Discover artifacts which have been found inside the restored 1933 former courthouse and post office buildings. A must for anybody who is interested in American history, the mob or if you're just looking for something a little different. 13. Shoot a gun. Not everybody's first choice and understandably so, however, Las Vegas offers an extensive number of shooting ranges. From indoor ranges to in the middle of the desert there's something for everybody who wants to shoot a gun. Choose from rifles to handguns and aim at the different targets. Ranges that are popular with Vegas tourists include. Battlefield Vegas, The Range, 702 Machine Guns Vegas, The Gun Store Las Vegas Strip Gun Club. You can invariably find great packages and deals on Groupon for shooting in Las Vegas. 14. Drive a supercar. What's better than driving a Lamborghini or a Ferrari? Driving a Lamborghini or a Ferrari up the strip of course. Hop in a luxury car and take it for a spin along one of the world's most well-known boulevards. You'll head out with an instructor and stop off to take some Instagram-worthy photos of you in the car. There are multiple places you can experience supercar heaven with on the Strip, Groupon or Rush 49, again have some great deals. Alternatively head to the race track and put the pedal to the metal around the loop in Ferraris, Porsches, Mustangs and Lambos. 
15. Watch the famous fountains. If you know anything about Vegas you'll know that the Bellagio fountains are an absolute spectacle. With the water seamlessly dancing to different music every hour it is not only enchanting but the perfect backdrop for many a proposal. Hordes of crowds gather to watch the fountains so make sure you get a good spot near the front. Alternatively heading to the other side of the strip is also good for viewing if you can't get to the front. If you're looking for a more upbeat fountain display than the iconic Bellagio fountains make sure you check out the fountains at the Win. These play a more light-hearted mix of songs from Disney classics to old favorites to get your toes tapping. 16. Let a robot make you a cocktail. Tipsy Robot, located in Planet Hollywood's Miracle Mile, takes robots to the extreme. Sit at your table, select, or create, your drink, pay and then watch bottles come from the ceiling to mix your drink. It is absolutely incredible to see and only in Vegas would you have a drink made solely by machine. Tipsy robots have the capacity to produce up to 120 drinks per hour. Each cocktail takes a mere 60 to 90 seconds to make. Watch as the mechanical marvels use exact measurements, ensuring a perfectly crafted sip every time. The robots have killer dance moves, too. And, if things ever get too busy, Tipsy Robot has a human team on standby at all times. You are able to select a pre-existing cocktail, add and remove one or more ingredients while adjusting the quantities according to your preference. You can also add garnishes and modify the actions to be performed by the robot. Finally, you can name your own drink and save it for a later order. 17. Spot a celebrity. A favorite getaway for the rich and famous, celebrities such as Drake, The Kardashians, Jamie Foxx, Bradley Cooper and George Clooney. Celebrities such as Celine Dion, Andre Agassi and Nicolas Cage call Las Vegas their home, so chances that you stumble across a famous face is highly likely. If you don't happen to spot the real deal celebrity then why not head to Madame Tussauds located at the front of the Venetian to have your photo taken with the waxworks. 18. Ride the high roller at the link. Vegas only observation wheel has made its mark not only on the Vegas skyline but as a thing to add to your Vegas bucket list. As the world's largest observation wheel, take in the views of the strip whilst traveling in one of the 28 pods. With the added option of the happy hour package, you can ride the wheel and take advantage of the free bar, where bartenders free pour drinks, give a good tip first time around, and drink as much as you can in the 30-minute journey. We highly recommend upgrading to happy hour as this makes the atmosphere even more enjoyable as the pod has a party vibe going on. 19. Live it up at a day club or pool party. When pool season hits, there is absolutely no shortage of pool parties. If you're looking to visit Vegas and not gamble then you must add at least one pool party to your bucket list. There are plenty day clubs on the strip, grab your most glamorous bikini and wedges combo or swim trunks if you're a guy and head to one of Vegas' most lively day parties. As a huge fan of a day club especially O Beach in Ibiza, Vegas takes great inspiration from the White Isle especially at daylight, at Mandalay Bay. With Rose All Day, theme on a Thursday and yoga sessions to help your body recover from the night before, this is a day club like no other. Bear Pool Lounge at the Mirage offers a tropical paradise with no judgment topless sunbathing. Check out the Strip's most notorious day club, Encore Beach Club at the Wynn where there are cabanas and the introduction of a new bar last year. MMA champ Conor McGregor often hosts events at Encore so keep your eyes peeled. We can't forget Wet Republic at MGM, one of the hottest day clubs around, with world-class DJs playing sets during the day. Head into the pool, enjoy drinks from the bar and book your own cabanas for an easy afternoon. Parties for days. Marquee at the Cosmopolitan makes use of the pool come rain or shine, this day club often erects the Marquee Dome during colder months to ensure that you can get your day club dance on. If you're looking for a day club with sensational views then make sure you head to Dre's Beach Club at the Cromwell. With the best club views over the strip, enjoy the critically acclaimed Best Beach Club Dining beside the two large pools. Looking for something a little more upmarket? Liquid at the Aria offers a more exclusive day club to align with the rest of the hotel. With an extensive drinks menu and champagne list, you can choose from a $15 glass of champagne right up to $17,500 for a 5-liter bottle of Verve Clicquot Yellow Label. Finally, if you're looking for a day club open 7 days then look no further than the Flamingos Go Pool Day Club. With an anything goes music policy. There are some total throwback classics to be heard. Spot a famous face at Go Pool as this is a celebrity favorite hangout. 20. Visit a rooftop bar. 
if you're wanting to save a few bucks by not paying to go up the Eiffel Tower or on the high roller at the link. Or if you're looking to enjoy a few drinks in the open and get a great view of the strip then head to a rooftop bar. Highly recommended bars include Voodoo at Rio, which is just west of the strip. If you're down at Rio, why not also check out Ghost Bar at the Palms. There's Marquis at the Cosmopolitan, on the Strip. As well as Beer Park located in Paris which serves over 100 different beers and ales. Commonwealth which is located downtown which also has a secret club which requires a password and bans PDA. Another downtown rooftop bar is the Roof Bar, do note this is only open 3 days a week. Oak and Ivy always tops most rooftop bar lists, again located downtown with an extensive whiskey selection. The bar is actually built in an old shipping container which is pretty cool. 21. Play Crazy Golf OR Head to Top Golf. Crazy Golf is always a good laugh, especially if you're the one who always loses like me. On and off the strip there are plenty of places to play Crazy Golf including Kiss at Rio. This Kiss-themed golf has you rocking to the sounds of the band in this 18-hole glow in the dark course. Can you put your ball through the platform, past the guitar and into Jean's mouth? Voted the best top golf Twilight Zone at Bally's is located on the strip. Again this 18-hole glow in the dark course features some pretty awesome graphics and surprises. If you're not looking for a round of crazy golf but like the idea of a little golf why not head to Top Golf at MGM Grand. This rooftop driving range uses luxury and is a range with a difference. Can you whack and put your balls into the different holes, each ball is registered to your account. As you challenge your friends the balls landing in the holes keep a score so that, just like bowling, you know who's winning. 22. Get married by Elvis. What happens in Vegas and all that. Famed for drive through weddings and little white wedding chapels on every corner. Las Vegas is a place to elope to or plan a crazy wedding. With almost all hotels also offering a wedding chapel why not get married in Vegas? Just try and not get married to a stranger. With over 20 chapels you can even hire a wagon to come out to you to perform your nuptials. 23. Head to Porn Stars. If you're not familiar with Porn Stars, it's a US television program, which chronicles the daily activities at the world-famous Gold and Silver Porn Shop, a 24-hour family business opened in 1989. Porn Stars is located about 15 minutes from the strip and is a frequent tourist spot. You can get the bus to Porn Star. Simply get the juice up to the bus terminal and get a connecting bus from there. If you're heading to Porn Stars it's probably recommended that you also go to the Neon Boneyard at the same time as they're very close together. 24. See the largest golden nugget in the world. Head down to Fremont Street and straight into the casino of the Golden Nugget. Head up towards the back keeping an eye out along the walls for the largest golden nugget in the world. This nugget has been named the Hand of Faith. Weighing 875 troy ounces, 960 ounces, 27,200 grams, and 18 inches, 46 centimeters, in length, the Hand of Faith was found near Kingawa, Victoria, Australia, and put on display at the casino in 1981 amid a number of other gold nuggets. 25. Watch the Viva Vision light show at Fremont Street. No visit to Vegas is complete without a stop off at Fremont Street. Admittedly the last time I visited I found it extremely underwhelming and if anything a bit seedy. However, I am partial to the light show which happens on the hour along the street. Make sure you don't miss the world's largest screen with different shows on it is a great watch. From Queen to The Who. Tiesto, Green Day and Linkin Park. 26. Visit the Container Park. Container parks are in vogue right now and Vegas has its very own downtown container park. Located on Fremont Street it is easily accessible from the Strip. This open-air shopping center is filled with boutique retail shops, unique restaurants, and live entertainment for the whole family and located in the heart of Las Vegas. From gourmet quick service dining at Downtown Terrace to award-winning beef jerky at JoJo's Jerky, there's something for everyone. There's an interactive playground featuring the treehouse for children and for adults, they can relax while enjoying free concerts, movies, and more on the main stage. 27. The Park. Explore the Park, an immersive outdoor dining and entertainment district located next to New York, New York. Where you can discover an unrivaled sports and entertainment venue the T-Mobile Arena. Home of the Vegas Knights, Lady Gaga's Enigma Residency and the Bliss Dance. Which is a breathtaking, 40-foot tall sculpture of a dancing woman, celebrating the strength of a woman who is both safe and present. 
The structure and scale of Bliss Dance have been inspired by artist Marco Cochran's first experience at Burning Man. Regardless if you're looking for a spot to gather with friends or to grab a quick bite before an epic show, the Park and T-Mobile Arena offer something for everyone. For food there are restaurants and fast food stops such as Beer House, Sake Rock, Shake Shack and The Pub. Looking for somewhere to enjoy a few more drinks? Juniper Cocktail Lounge is just a short walk from the park. 28. Watch a sports game. Held at the Thomas and Mack Center since 1985, the rodeo final gathers the world's best cowboys and barrel racers for rodeo's premier and richest event. The season's 15 top performers compete at back riding, steer wrestling, team roping, saddle bronc riding, tie down roping, barrel racing and bull riding. If you're not into the annual event you might be interested in the Vegas Golden Knights. Don your hockey jersey and head to the T-Mobile Arena, located at the park, to cheer on Las Vegas' first major league sports team. When in the US I always think you should get involved in their rich love of sports. What's better than a game of ice hockey in the desert? Fight night. If you're not into NHL, you might be into a little bit of fighting? Make no mistake Vegas is the heavyweight when it comes to hosting multi-million dollar fighters. From names such as Floyd Mayweather, Conor McGregor, Evander Holyfield, Mike Tyson to Manny Pacquiao and Sugar Ray Leonard. Vegas has hosted some incredible bouts. The MGM is famed for their ring and with a packed schedule, you could find yourself amongst world-famous celebrities cheering on your favorite fighter. 29. Take a helicopter ride above the Strip. If you're doing Vegas properly, do it in style with a helicopter ride over the Strip. There's no better way to see the makeup of the world's famous hotel strip than with a bird's eye view. Grab your camera and get ready for unrivaled views from the helicopter. Are you brave enough to take up Doors Off Tour, it does exactly as it says. Flies you into the sky over the strip with Doors Off for the best views from the sky. You can also incorporate a flight down the strip with a day tour by helicopter to the Grand Canyon. There are plenty of reputable tour companies who provide this kind of trips. Viator, Best Deals Papillon, Maverick Helicopters, Strip Tours. 30. Gondola ride at the Venetian I'd say when in Rome, but you're in Venice when you head inside the Venetian. Make sure you take a trip around either the inside and outside of the hotel down the Grand Canal. Enjoy the vibrant Venetian streetscape whilst your singing gondolier takes you for an unforgettable ride. If you're visiting Vegas with somebody special in your life then step back in time as you climb into an old world gondola which, funnily enough, has been voted the most romantic thing to do in Vegas by USA Today. If you're wondering which ride is best between indoor and outdoor, they both are different. Offering their own unique views which are equally as enthralling and romantic. Looking for something a little more than a gondolier ride? Welcome to Gondola University. A the most asked question to a gondolier at the Venetian is, how can I become a gondolier? Now people have the opportunity to try for a few hours through the Gondola University program. This is limited to nine participants per day and shares the ins and outs of piloting a gondola. Participants receive a gondola hat and t-shirt, a souvenir photo and a degree certificate from Gondola University. 31. Ride through a tunnel of sharks at the Golden Nugget. If you're a thrill seeker then a trip to the Golden Nugget might make it on your Vegas bucket list when you discover that they have a water slide that goes through their 200,000 gallon shark tank. This $30 million pool development boasts a slide which starts 30 feet high and throws you right between fish and sharks in the tank. There's more to the tank than just a rip-riding water slide. There's a whole shark tank tour that you can go on to discover all about sharks, the misconceptions that you have. The real facts about what sharks actually eat, you can also discover about their behavior as well as seeing behind the scenes of daily shark life. 32. Conservatory and Botanical Gardens at Bellagio. The best thing about the conservatory and botanical gardens which are located at the Bellagio is that they are forever changing. You'll never visit twice on different trips and it remain the same. From the exquisite Christmas displays to the Chine's New Year opulence. The conservatory and botanical gardens are forever changing. With warm colors in spring and light displays in summer it really is something special and extremely different every single time. If you're fortunate to visit whilst they're changing the conservatory then you'll see just how much work goes into each display. With a team working with military precision it's absolutely incredible to watch. 33. Visit the fabulous Nevada Vegas sign. Welcome to fabulous Las Vegas Nevada. If you've not been to visit one of the most iconic signs in the world then why the hell not? 
located at the southern end of the strip next to Mandalay Bay the sign is an accessible walk. Fact, the sign, like most of the strip, sits in paradise and is located roughly 4 miles .4 kilometers south of the actual city limits of Las Vegas. Such distinctions are usually ignored by both locals and tourists, who refer to the entire metro area as Las Vegas. 34. Instagram the Seven Magic Mountains. An Instagram lover's essential bucket list destination when in Las Vegas. The Seven Magic Mountains is a public art installation designed to bring a little color to a drab desert. Each of the seven pillars contains brightly colored limestone boulders which are between 30 to 35 feet tall. The installation took five years to make and cost $3.5 million to install. The Seven Magic Mountains are located on the freeway which connects Vegas to California. So if you don't see it on the drive-in, kudos if you get the hangover reference, then do take a trip out to see them. 35. Go skiing at Mount Charleston. If you're looking to get away from the bright light city which sets your soul on fire then how about a trip to Charleston Peak? This is an all-year-round getaway for Las Vegas residents and visitors alike. Boasting a number of hiking trails and a modest ski area, the mountain is snow-capped for over half of the year. It can actually be seen from parts of the Strip when looking to the west. Mount Charleston is about a one-hour drive from the Strip and is a great place to go if you're looking for an escape. 36. Visit an art gallery. Everywhere you look in Las Vegas hotels you'll discover art. From statement pieces to the plain obscure each hotel has turned into their own art gallery. However, if you're looking for something a little more cultured than playing the slots then there are several art galleries you can visit in Vegas. Some are home to world-renowned collections. The Bellagio Gallery of Fine Art had people in shock when it opened in 1998, bringing fine art to the heart of Sin City was almost an oxymoron. However this busy art gallery has played home to Monet and Warhol and changes exhibitions often. In contrast to the Bellagio's gallery, head to the Neon Boneyard for arguably one of the most personal to Vegas, and in my opinion most favorite, modern galleries the Neon Museum, featured as number 9. There's also the P3 Studio at the Cosmopolitan, Centerpiece Gallery, Barrack Museum, Contemporary Arts Center, Trifecta Gallery, Lou Ruvo Center, Clark County Government Center and Big Springs Gallery to let your inner artist feast on. 37. Hoover Dam. One of the most well-known dams in the world is located just a 45-minute drive from Las Vegas Boulevard. This concrete arch-gravity dam in the Black Canyon of the Colorado River which is on the border between Nevada and Arizona is somewhere you simply must visit to discover just how spectacular it really is. If you're taking the Grand Canyon bus trip, you will pass the Hoover Dam and most excursions will stop for photo opportunities too. Not planning on heading out to the Grand Canyon but want to see the Hoover Dam? The best way for you to do this is to hire a car for 24 hours, if you're going to the Hoover Dam via hire car then also make sure that you visit the Valley of Fire while you're out that way too. You can hire a car for as little as £22 per day. 38. The Ice Rink at the Cosmopolitan, Winter Only. If it's winter then you bet I'm on an ice rink somewhere and there's nowhere quite as special as skating at the Cosmopolitan. Each holiday season the boulevard pool is transformed into a winter wonderland up above the Las Vegas Strip. Skate across 4,200 square feet of real ice. Even toast s'mores by the fire and get really into the holiday spirit by indulging in seasonal food and drinks. The pool area is transformed into a magical, park-like space where you can skate whilst watching the twinkling lights of the Strip. Enjoy periodic light snowfall throughout the evening too. The ice rink was named one in the top 10 of USA Today's best ice skating rinks in North America too. 39. Enjoy a well-deserved spa day. Sometimes you've got to just take a break from the bright lights and neon, the chinging of the slot machines and the drunks with their bums out on the strip. Cupid, I'm looking at you. Sometimes you've got to just unplug, unwind and recharge with a couple of hours in the spa. Of course, Vegas offers the most exquisite of spas in on and off strip hotels. We've researched the top 5 spas in Las Vegas so you don't have to. 1. Waldorf Astoria This two-story spa features 17 treatment rooms, relaxation lounges, steam rooms, a hammam, a vitality pool with views of the strip, a salon, and a separate Chinese foot spa for pedicures. It's somewhat small for a Vegas spa, but it's one of the most decadent. 2. Aria This luxury mega resort features a luxury mega spa. Featuring a full-service salon, 62 treatment rooms. 
a vast treatment menu, and a relaxing ambience thanks to its Japanese-style heated stone beds, salt room, outdoor therapy pool, and natural light. 3. Palazzo and Venetian The Canyon Ranch Spa Club will dazzle you with unique features. Complete with crystal steam rooms, a wave room, igloo, think arctic mists meet fiber optics, and salt grotto. The fitness facilities include a 40-foot climbing wall, pilates, personal training, and a top-notch gym. 4. Caesars one of the biggest spa facilities on the Strip. The funky accoutrements including a tea sommelier and an arctic ice room with falling snow set this spa apart from the rest. The services menu is expansive. It includes world-exclusive Nobu-branded treatments. For a fee, guests get access to the Roman baths, Laconium steam baths, Vichy showers, as well as chakra balancing crystal, body art rooms, a herbal steam room, cedar sauna, and the expansive fitness center. 5. The cosmopolitan the Sara Spa and Hammon aims to astound with its canyon-like walls that evoke the desert. Hot stone slabs in the steam room and private spa suites decked out with whirlpool tubs, wet bars, and flat-screen TVs. Sara's elaborate service menu includes Turkish and Moroccan-inspired bath rituals, high-tech facials, and stone massages. 40. Get cupcakes from an ATM. Head down the promenade at the link and you'll discover places to dine, drink and shop. Next to the fountain, you'll also stumble upon Sprinkles. A cupcake lover's paradise. What's really cool about Sprinkles is that they have a cupcake ATM which dispenses cupcakes like a cash point. It's a really novel idea and adorned in frosted pinks the ATM always pulls a crowd. 41. Brunch at Wicked Spoon. If you don't do buffets why not try and change your mind with the best buffet in Vegas, in my opinion, at the Cosmopolitan. Swanky, quality-focused eatery The Wicked Spoon offers an unrivaled buffet service like no other. This bustling culinary food hall serves up well-crafted original selections for every appetite, including the fussiest of eaters. Mixing top quality, familiar staples and imaginative seasonal dishes this is a favorite spot of mine for a bottomless brunch. Reasonably priced, there is no shortage of dishes to choose from all served in their own copper saucepans. If you have a sweet tooth the dessert stand is to die for. Jam-packed with an assortment of Bruce Bogtrotter-worthy cakes, tarts, mousses, pastries and more. 42. See the world's largest permanent circus. Tell me by now you haven't grasped that everything happens in Vegas? Head up to the north end of the Strip to Circus Circus, one of the real OGs of Las Vegas. Head into the Big Top and watch as acts fly through the air with the greatest of ease. The world's largest permanent circus highlights the center stage of the Carnival Midway daily to showcase the best of their circus performers. With the circus performances absolutely free you can be charmed and entertained from 11.30 am daily regardless if you're a hotel guest or just visiting. Their world-class acts in the Big Top include Flying Poemas, High Flying Trapeze Tricks from Argentina Hossein, Performing Feats of Strength and Balance from Iran Naira, a stunning aerial display on the silk from Argentina. Dave, Tonya, Rocco and Huel the wild and wacky circus circus clowns. Louis, juggling artistry with the Diablo from Argentina. Cherifan Troop, high energy troupe of acrobats from Morocco. Big Bear Lan incredible skill and strength performed on a slack wire from the Imperial Acrobats of China. Free Ladderman, a fantastic feat of balance and skill using a ladder and the German wheel from Russia. Pei Pei and Wang Jing, duo skilled in the art of unicycles and foot juggling from the Imperial Acrobats of China. 43. Enjoy cocktails at Sugar Factory. Of course, there are cocktails at every possible stop on and off the strip. In fact, you'll see plenty of people walking with yards of frozen cocktails mainly from either Fat Tuesdays or Senior Frogs all over. However, there's no cocktail I enjoy more in Vegas than a goblet from Sugar Factory. It's essential to visit Sugar every time we head to Vegas for one of their dry ice, fishbowl cocktails. Choose from a huge list of different cocktails, some designed by Drake and Pitbull. Then get ready to boomerang when your server brings it over. They are priced at over $35 per goblet, however, one alone should get you super wavy. And when in Vegas right? 44. Watch the fall of Atlantis show at Caesars. Why pay for shows in Vegas when there's so much to see and do for free? That's why you really can enjoy Las Vegas on a budget. The Fall of Atlantis show, which is inside the forum shops at Caesars, is an animatronic display of fire, water and nine feet tall talking statues. With an enchanting story, it is set in the Kingdom of Atlantis. When King Atlas has to decide which of his bratty children will rule the throne. 
If you thought your sibling rivalry was bad, it doesn't even come close to these two. This feud is fierce. In the end, the family learns the ultimate lesson. While we'd normally hate to spoil the ending, it does get busy and sometimes it can be a little hard to understand what's being said. Saying that we do enjoy narrating the story ourselves for a laugh. It plays on the hour, every hour starting from 11 a.m. daily. If you do go to see Fall of Atlantis do make sure that you check out the 50,000 gallon aquarium nearby. There are more than 300 saltwater fish in this impressive habitat. 45. Watch it rain indoors at Planet Hollywood. You might stumble upon it whilst shopping down at Miracle Mile shops or you might head there especially to see the free rainstorm show at Planet Hollywood. You can't miss this miracle in the desert which includes thunder, lightning, fog and pouring rain all inside the shopping forum. See the show Monday to Thursday the top of each hour from 10 a.m. until 11 p.m. daily. Friday through to Sunday watch it every half hour from 10 a.m. until 11 p.m. 46. Get wrapped up and visit an ice bar. If you're looking for a cool place to get a drink then we highly recommend the Minus 5 experience. With two locations, Mandalay Bay and the Venetian you can chill until you need thawing. With the whole place made from ice from the walls to the chandeliers, the seats and sculptures which change all year round to the glasses you enjoy your drinks in. Head to Minus 5 and get kitted out in gloves and a warm parka or faux fur coat then head into the winter wonderland of interactive ice architecture. Worried about the ambience? There are LED lights shows and some great music. No photography is allowed in the bar, as professional photographers capture your time and offer some merchandise when leaving. 47. Ride the Bullet PBR Bar. Have you ever been to Vegas when the rodeo is in town? That is something next level. If you fancy your chances of seeing how you'd fare riding the bull, head to the PBR Bar outside the Miracle Mile at Planet Hollywood and climb on. This is up there with one of my favorite bars on the strip after Carnival Court at Harris that's my favorite ever. It's good for cocktails and light bites too. If you've seen the 100 ounces cocktail video that circles on Facebook frequently this is also where you'll get your hands on one of them. It's a great place to sit and people watch too. 48. Discover secret pizza in the Cosmopolitan. Usually, I don't chase my food. We're past the Neanderthal era after all. However, there's something alluring about finding a secret dining area. Secret Pizza located in the Cosmopolitan is just that. Open until 4 a.m., this pizza joint is difficult to find, however, if you ask about you can get directions to this no-frills hearty New York Italian pizza place. With the pizza dough, meatballs and other specialities made in-house fresh that day and pizza slices starting at just $3 and then 50 cents for each topping it is extremely great value for strip food. Make no mistake this is not fine dining. With bar stool chairs and limited seating, the excitement is in finding the place. Directions to Secret Pizza, go upstairs from the front door using the escalator. Look directly to your right once you've gone as far as you can. Once you spot a corridor full of old album covers, you've found it. Then simply follow the short hallway. There is no signage, remember it's a secret. 49. Soak in the atmosphere at CARNAVAL Court. Undoubtedly my favorite bar in the whole world, a bold claim, I know. Carnival Court is the first place that I head to when I arrive in Vegas. Located at the center of the strip between Harris and the Link this outdoor bar is small but mighty. This open-air street party really brings the party both night and day. Enjoy live music from live bands and DJs who keep the crowds really revved up all day. On stage one minute, dancing on the bar the next you never know what's in store which keeps visiting exciting. With an eclectic mix of people, it is also a great place to people watch one of my favorite things to do. One of the best parts of Carnival Court is the charismatic flair bartenders who put on a show themselves when getting your drink ready. Let them dazzle as they prepare your drinks and I guarantee they'll have you laughing all afternoon. Nightclub venue underneath the stars? Count us in. When the sun sets on Sin City this bar turns into a really spectacular nightclub with strip views that are unrivaled. No trip to Vegas is complete without a visit to Carnival Court. 50. Search out street performers. Las Vegas is a treasure trove of talent. Just walk up and down the strip and you'll see street performers from magicians to acrobatics. These short shows last around 15 minutes and are absolutely amazing. Usually, they end with the performers asking for tips for their performances, this is not mandatory however if you've enjoyed their show a couple of dollars would never go amiss. Want more Vegas? 
Check out elleblonde.com or subscribe to our channel.